All right, guys. Today we're playing as Dark Side in Twisted Metal on the PlayStation One. So let's get right into it. All right, Dick Side. This character, as we've all come to know and hate, absolutely is the worst special in this entire game. By far, easy picking worst special. But with that being said, he also has the best special in the game. What is that, you may ask? Well. It's the power of touch. When he touches you, you're just fucking dead. And that's the beauty of Dark Side. You can just go up to someone, tell them to bend over, touch their butt, and they're gone. They just obliterated. It's that easy. So Dark Side really isn't much of a pain in this game to play as. It's just really one of those things where it's like, why does he have a special weapon at all when it pretty much does nothing? And it's, it, it's just dumb. It's got the smallest hitbox in the entire game next to Crimson Furies. And when you get a hit with it, it barely flicks damage on people. So in reality, you're better off just not even using it. Just try to get up as much ammo as you can with everything else and just ram people, dude. Just ram the shit out of everybody. It's awesome. Try to get some hits. Look at that. Like, the <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he says, into his death. Yeah. The only car I'm a little bit scared of is Warthog and probably Thumper because both of them can do a lot of damage up close. So I gotta be careful about that. I'm not indestructible, obviously. I wanna try to get a direct hit with my special so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Let's see if I can get hit on Thumper. We'll actually come out of the corner. Hello? Nope, missed. There we go, we got a hit. Did you see it? Look at that. Look at that beauty amount of damage. It's absolutely devastating. They're gonna remember that for months from now. Die. I got tired of that. It's just so fun to ram into people and just destroy them in one hit. Like, it's just crazy. Yeah. Honk, honk. <laughs> see you later. It's just wild to me that this game did not have any type of balancing when it comes to the ram damage. It's just some cars can obliterate others in one touch, other ones it takes like 300 hits to do any damage. It just, look at that. It's so weird to me how that was overlooked. But, you know, maybe TM1 was rushed more than we even know. I don't really know the development details of TM1 all that much. There's not a whole lot of data on it. If people know for sure in the comment section, let me know how much time went into TM1's development because if I was to make an educated guess, I'd say about 11 months. I doubt they had more than a year. At least I kind of hope they did not, because if they had more than a year and this was the outcome, I get it, it's the first of its kind, but Jesus Christ. Oh my God, even Sweet Tooth's getting obliterated. This is crazy. Look at that, that's just stupid. I feel like speedrunners for TM1 should definitely use Dark Side more than anything. I feel this car has the best potential for just getting through a level or getting through a playthrough, I should say, just incredibly fast. I'm really curious to see how long this video is going to be. It's probably going to be a short one. <laughs> and I want to apologize that I know I have not been uploading a lot of videos as of late. They've been pretty scarce uh, in terms of my upload schedule. But genuinely, it's just because I don't want to upload videos that I don't have fun with, and I don't want to push myself to make videos just to make videos, you know? If I have the creative drive to do it, I'm going to do it, and that's what I've been doing with these videos as of late. But if I don't, I'm not pushing it. The other thing, too, is I've just been very much loving live streaming. It's like, that's become my thing. And I think a lot of you also agree that live streaming is kind of where my content shines. And I understand not everybody can make it to the live streams and watching the VODs is not nearly as fun as the live stream itself. And I do apologize about that. But that's why I hired my editor, Buck O'Brien, and he's been putting together some amazing edits of previous streams. So I highly recommend if you can't make it to the stream or even if you've been there in the stream and you see a new video of mine go up, give it a try because it's almost like an entirely new thing with all the edits that he puts into it. There's a lot of work gone into those videos. So I really, really, really would appreciate it. So thank you so much for everybody who does and everybody who's been sticking around with the live streams as well. I mean, it's it's been an absolute pleasure these last few months. Been having a lot of fun with it. But I obviously don't want to give up on my video crowd. I know a lot of you guys don't care about streams and you just are here for the videos and you're sticking, you're sticking strong, you're sticking with it and I appreciate all of you for that. 
So I'm trying to get more content out there. It's just I don't want to force anything and I don't want the content to suffer because of it. So I hope that's understandable. Yeah. No. Damn it. Oh, is Pippa ever dead? Yep, she did. Oh, this is the thing that sucks about this character, though. He's so slow that when there's that time you want to actually get away, you are kind of stuck. But we got away. We got lucky. Oh, my, my arch nemesis, Warthog. Pretty much the only character next to Thumper in the game that can obliterate me in front, uh, like, up close range. Because he also has a broken hitbox, where if you touch him, he'll also kill you. It's quite wonderful. Sweet tooth. Sweet tooth. My boy. Just, just go to rest. Just go to bed. Same with your father. Blood Ryan. <laughs> the bloodline ended. <laughs> Alright. Now we got Outlaw and Grim. Mist feels bad. Outlaw might screw me up too. Oh god. I mean, I'm like totally stuck. What the hell? Just go, 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 go. Please. This is the full health area, I think. Yes. Full free heal. I love that shit. They should have brought that back in the future games. I know TM Black has full heals that are secret. Same with TM2. But I would love to see that in like 3, 4, 2012 head on. Small Brawl. Maybe if we get a new brand new game, you know. They'll bring that stuff back. Little Easter eggs. That'd be super neat. I've also noticed it seems to only do damage when you're backing into somebody or if you're running into someone. If they're hitting you, like T-boning you, doesn't seem to do all that much damage. Which I suppose makes sense, and it's a good thing they actually did think about that. Another tricky thing about these videos right now, or this month I should say, is that I'm going to be going on an 11 day cruise starting October 24th. So from the 24th to November 4th, I am going to be MIA. Uh, I'm going to try my best to be in the Discord because I did pay for an internet package that hopefully should work for Discord on the on my phone. So I will try to keep up to date on that. I'll probably post some updates in the community tab. But obviously during this time, I'm not going to be able to stream. I'm not going to be able to make content and there's going to be a big lull uh, of uploads. But but hear me out. I'm trying my best to get uploads to go out while I'm away. And the way this is going to work is I'm pre-recording a lot of these videos. So this video right now, you might be watching and it might already be past October 24th. I don't know when these videos are going up. And if you're seeing this video and it's past that time, I'm already on the cruise and I hope everyone's doing well while I'm gone. But the main thing is that uh, I'm going to be having more videos uploaded while I'm gone. And my plan is to have at least one video going up a week from this point on. So I don't want to skip multiple weeks in a row without videos. And I do want to get to the point of uploading multiple videos a week. That'd be my dream, of course. And I, of course, don't want to change my streaming schedule either. So I want to be able to stream three days a week and also upload, you know, two or more videos a week would be the absolute my dream. But uh, right now, just with my work schedule and everything, it's just impossible. So being able to do one video a week is going to be tough. I'm not going to lie. But I'm going to do my absolute best to make sure that happens. And on top of that, not make the content suffer in terms of, you know, having to push myself to make videos, if that makes sense. I want them to be genuinely good videos and fun to watch and all that stuff. So yeah, just bear with me during this kind of lull right now, and I promise new and better content is on the way, and it will be here very, very soon. Yeah, there we go. So one thing that's funny with me is that when you touch Grim, he should be the one that insta dies in this game, but it sometimes takes multiple hits for him, and I don't know why. But yet Spectre just it gets obliterated. I suppose the one really good thing about having good ram damage is you don't have to worry a whole lot about having a ton of weapons. You can just kind of freeze people and ram the shit out of them. Like, look at that roadkill. Half his health gone already. Dead. And Darkseid doesn't even feel that slow in this game. I genuinely thought he'd be a lot slower than this. He feels pretty quick. These rear attacks. They only one of those hit him. 
Not sure. I was just gonna go. Can we either do any damage to Amred? Kind of. Get back your boy. I can't tell who's hurting who. I think he's hurting me. Okay, there we go. We did kill him. All right, Yellow Jacket's almost dead. I'm gonna die though. Uh oh, Spectre, get away! Special, please, brother. All right, we need to kill Spectre. We can't let that happen again. Where are you, little boy? Ghost ass. I'm gonna smush him. We hit you. What the hell? <laughs> Just pushing him around like a hockey puck on an ice rink. Come on. Come here. You're dead. You're dead. There we go. Nuisance destroyed. It's funny how much damage Sweet Tooth takes from these. I didn't expect him to get hurt that bad. But he's one of the easiest ones to kill. Here comes a tough one. Because he just spams his special the whole time. Yeah, we killed him with a special. No way. That'll never happen again. I'm genuinely curious to see how much damage we can do to Minion with Dark Side's ram damage. I don't know if it's going to do much at all, but curious to see. Screw it. Dark Side's going to church. Satan, time to pray. Uh, come on, boy. Come on, Jesus. Give me a solid. Are you kidding me? Oh, thank God. That was gonna be some Easter egg or something where it's like Satan can't actually heal it at the church. <laughs> That'd have been funny. I'm the Ram Master. You are ass. Alright, now it's just Grim. Which should be easy as long as I don't get uh, special spam, I suppose. Oh, come on. There we go. Yes! Come on, come on, one more touch. Tooch. Touch him. Yeah. Easy peasy, baby. Dark side on the rooftops. Final battle. Come on. Yes. We got some homing missiles, powers, freezes. I've noticed with Minion that best way to destroy him is just use power missiles and and uh, homing missiles as long as you got those two you're good but I'm really genuinely oh I almost pushed him off that would have been funny no damage whatsoever with that oh he fell <gasps> it is possible to push people off now I, I do know that with Grim or uh, not Grim but with Minion that is not possible to do for some stupid reason he just teleports nice but yeah, I've noticed with Minion, if you push him off the level, he just teleports back up and doesn't even take any damage. I don't know why they have it set up that way, but it, it is the way it is, I guess. All right, come on, Crimson, there we go. All right, we don't have any extra lives, but Onion is coming. So I just gotta hope I got enough and the ramming damage will be good enough. We'll see. What the hell? Dude. Hit me from through the floor. That makes sense. Alright, we got him with the weapons. Oh, as expected, this is not... <laughs> Ramming does not do much damage to this guy. Oh god, this is a mistake! Yep. Well, I've learned my lesson. We can't really kill him with ramming. We have to just stack up a ton of weapons. It's gonna be the only way to kill this guy. Oh wow, Jesus Christ, bro. Okay, I didn't expect you to get me in a corner like that. Fucking bitch. Oh God, hopefully the full heal's still around. I don't think I got it yet. Nope, we haven't gotten it yet, good. There we are. Whew. 
Damn, I'm surprised with how good we did throughout the entire playthrough. This is the first time we failed against Minion. Yellow Jacket and Sweet Tooth, it was easy as pie. But just, you know, it is what it is. Look at that. See, he drives off. And... He drives around. And he should teleport. Hold on. Or is he just stuck? What? He got hurt a little bit. Oh god, I'm not gonna make it. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, we made it. I don't know where Minion is, though. Alright. Somehow, okay, somehow he did get up there. I, did, I didn't see where he landed, but... Cool. Oh, you bitch, don't turn me around. Come on. There we go. Come on! No, you're eating my ass! Let's try this again. I'm messing him up. I have one more power. Come on, damn it. Oh, I missed it! Fuck me! Oh, it's over. Maybe? <gasps> we did it! Oh, third time's a charm. Alright, let's go. That was way more difficult than it needed to be. You are the winner of the competition and are granted an audience with Calypso, the creator of Twisted Metal Contest. As you speed in his underground garage, you spot him surrounded by bodyguards and seats on the throne of a broken car parts. His face is burnt beyond recognition. His smile is stupid. When he recognizes you, his face goes pale. No, he screams. He's mine. He's mine. He's not yours, you tell him. He's one of the most powerful demons and you stole him used him to gather up your prizes for this competition of yours let's go black it's time to come home and with that a shadowy figure on the back wall of the garage flies out of the darkness and into your head disappearing into your body calypso screams in agony you simply smile he's coming back home with me you say your contest your vision is over for good see you in hell calypso i'll be waiting you speed off into the LA night, searching for the expressway back to hell. You hear it is located somewhere near Hollywood. <laughs> Dumb jokes. I do like that ending a lot. It's pretty much the exact same one as we got in the Lost ending, but obviously the acting and everything was amazing in the Lost ending. I wish we could have gotten that for the final build, but that's okay. Still a pretty decent ending all around. Always fun to come back to this one. And Darkseid, as shitty as a special is in this game, Genuinely is not that bad. His armor is really good. Obviously, his ram damage is broken. Speed and hailing isn't that bad either. So, he's a good pick, I think, even for speedrunning purposes. I just am not that good with him. And I have not learned the ways of the ramming in this game quite yet. But with that, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like, share, support as always. Subscribe so you don't miss the next one. Hopefully, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.